Pinan here coming to you from Mie Prefecture for the Kusumarian. Happy New Year's! With a first week sale of 0.8 KSM to a high sale of 71 KSM, a floor of 200 KSM, and a volume of 840 KSM at the time of reporting, you'd think that being one of the most successful collections on Singular would be enough. Buddies, which started as a fun crowdfunding project for a real-life CBD company by the Kilt Master, had its volume and floor rapidly rise to such a place that he decided the collection needed to live up to its hype. And hasn't it? What started at around 3K in the bank is now this. Focused on providing financial utility, no matter bear or bull, this bank has performed somewhere between 6 to 13x in 6 months, depending on what you consider the start date, paying out on the first pay period 1.4 to 5.5 KSM per NFT based on rarity. The bank now sits at roughly 25k worth at the time of this writing, after payouts. They've done this with their Buddies Alpha Trading Tool, which provides trading calls for education and not financial advice. The calls are made from a combination of sources with macroeconomics and learning tools provided so that holders are empowered. Alpha Trading has a success rate of 71%, recently approaching 82%, and there's a heavy emphasis on risk management with tight stop losses. In terms of traditional finance, this could be something akin to an alpha trading community meets prop trading. Prop trading is where you get a firm's money to trade it for them, acting like an independent contractor that can keep a majority of the profits. Buddies has a total supply of 50 with 35 unique holders. It's clearly an elite and exclusive group, but Buddies is now expanding. Moon Buddies will be a generation two project with a total supply of 500, launching quarter one, 2023 on Exosama Network. The Mint will be on Buddies website and they will be listed on Rare Sama. OG Buddies will remain on Kusama. The Moon Buddies model will be similar to OG Buddies with trading signals, macro news and education, yield hunting, games, airdrops and raffles, and importantly, their own unique trading bank. The biggest difference to keep in mind is that with a larger supply, the results will scale accordingly, and rarity has no impact on bank return. Mint price is TBA, but it will be purchased with Sama token. 20% of the mint will go to starting up the new Moon Buddies Bank, 10% to the Treasury, 5% to the OG Buddies Bank, and the rest to the founders and expenses. Rarity will be in art only, and there will be 10 one-on-ones. No Moon Buddies are being kept by the founder, but collaborators will receive a portion of eight total free mints with another two held for marketing. Not to be forgotten for their early faith, OG Buddies will get one free Moon Buddy per NFT owned. And like board members, they'll have 10x governance power compared to Moon Buddies. You could consider this Gen 2 Mint an increase in funding by the prop firm, or in our case, the open NFT community. But profitability isn't all that there is to Buddies. Originally, it was all about fun, right? Buddies has Skybreach and BitCountry metaverse lands. Holders will be able to manage assets and play mini games in them. There's a CBD city game still in the plans, but the focus has been on creating measurable value first. As for further roadmap, innovation and value is key to the collection. Yes, your buddies eventually will become equipable, and there will be an official comic airdrop to OG holders, staking, a token with utility in games, merch, NFTs, and extra trading calls. Out of respect for those who bought OG buddies on secondary, on singular, a special buddies box will be rewarded to these members. And what about these bongs that were airdropped to OG buddies? Well, you burn them, of course. And your buddies will get high. Duh. Are you impressed by this incredible display of delivery first, even in a bear? Let us know your thoughts. Have a great day, everyone. Mm -hmm.